Products Industry, the Abacha government granted licenses to private concerns to provide telephony services around the country. We have in the last four years approved the provision of telecommunication facilities in many locations across the country in pursuit of excellence in this very important sector of our economy. Although we still have some way to go in meeting the total telecommunication needs of the nation, a lot of ground has been covered by Nigerian telecommunications in the last few years. It is a realization of the increasing need for private sector participation in the industry that we commence action to aid private participation in the provision of telecommunication services. Today, at least two private operators have commenced services to the public. Two private satellite broadcasting stations began operations during the Abache years, in addition to many private television stations in many states. Abacha also had a vision for Nigeria, a vision of economic prosperity, political stability, and social harmony. A Nigeria that by the year 2010 will be largely developed in all sense. Now that we have attained a modest level of stability, we are faced with the greater challenge of how to consolidate the gains we have recorded. We have to concretize our achievements and determine objectives for our country in the short, medium, and long term. In this regard, I'm proud to state that Nigeria is now ready to adopt a more systematic and carefully phased out approach to the development of the nation. Time is indeed right for us to have a definite vision of the type of society we want, especially one that is economically prosperous, politically stable, and socially harmonious. Properly defined, this vision should provide a strategic insight into the direction in which the nation needs to move as well as a proper focus on the formation of programs and policies which should lead us to the realization of the future of our dream. On November 27, 1996, Abacha inaugurated the Vision 2010 Committee, made up of distinguished and eminent patriots charged with the responsibility of fashioning out a proper bearing for the country's economic, political, social, and cultural progress. Set appropriate goals and time frame for achieving them. Vision 2010 Committee carried out its assignment as its recommendations have now formed part of national development objective. This is the main report which I want to present to you all and on behalf of the nation. Because we all work the NDC has for the nation. And we train this for the nation as well. Once again, I thank you very much for the great opportunity which you've given each and every one of us to be able to do this. It's a contribution to the development of our country. Thank you very much. The Petroleum Special Trust Fund, PTF, is an intervention fund where money realized from the increased pump price of petroleum products is channeled to restoration of the country's dilapidated infrastructure, repair and equipping of schools and other educational institutions, health institutions, roads and more. Firstly, we have the take-off projects. These are projects that are manifestly clear. Everybody in Nigeria knows the roads are in terrible condition. And it's not only costing lives, it's costing property. And so much inefficiency, evacuation of farm products, evacuation of industrial goods, 
you get so much of overhead charging because uh, the roads are so terrible. So we got the roads. Health is the same thing. For the last 15 years, the health sector has been declining terribly. Education, water, these things are so visible and are so clear that uh, uh, you don't need uh, really a very big uh, outfit or what to tell you. Everybody can feel it. I think hence the reaction when people want to start to see the results. Um, so what we do, once it is identified, and mainly the road, we take them from north to south, east to the main road, uh, that carry the farm products, the industrial goods, and finish, uh, and raw material, and so on. And that's very clear. The state were asked to send uh, two primary schools for local government that are to be rehabilitated. One secondary school for a senatorial district, and one maybe technical college, higher education college, polytechnic for a state, and then all the federal government colleges and the universities. So we are going into them to pick priorities. Mainly it's going to be uh, a renovation, then equipping and re-equipping, you know, of laboratories, uh, equipping workshops, and then libraries. This is what we are going to do, and it's going to be so comprehensive. The impact of the PTF is beginning to be felt. Abacha believed in the philosophy that Africans are their brother's keepers. He believed that events in one country affect its neighbors because of historical ties, shared values, and most importantly, common African heritage.